Hello friends. So here's a very simple stretch you could do at your desk or anytime you want to eliminate discomfort or stiffness in your neck, back, hip, glute or hamstrings. Okay, so very simple stretch to do sitting. Starting with your neck, you can just fold your arms behind your back or you can press up against a chair if you want or sit up nice and tall. Inhale first, as you exhale, just drop your neck, shoulder and ear, right? And you wanna make sure you drive the shoulders back and down when you're doing your neck stretches. Long and strong. Okay, always breathing. And you can even stretch your arms up nice and long. As you stretch, you can also look up, right? Get that stretch right in the front and the side. You can also inhale. Exhale and look down and turn the arm. Don't be afraid to play with your arms, like twisting it. It changes the angle of the stretch a little bit and it feels amazing. So you can get the back. Inhale, exhale, right? Play around, don't be afraid to experiment. You can even grab the back of the chair and just open up that chest. You can also do the neck while you have your chest open. So many things you can do using a chair, okay? So you can open up that chest that way or even grab the back of that chair. Now listen, you guys are gonna have to hold the stretches 20 to 30 seconds to really feel the tension release, okay? I'm just going through them really quickly so to show you how to do it, all right? so. Inhale and exhale, always breathing deep and strong. All right, so this opens up the chest, so it takes away a lot of the trap tightness back here, right? You can even grab, again, if you need that, that's okay too. Even grab the bottom and stretch it, looking up and exhale, okay? Lots of ways you can do your chest stretch. All right, and going into your side, all right? You can also open up your knees, reach up, reach over. Pressing up against the thigh, all right? Pressing up against the thigh, keeping that open, stretching a little bit of the inner thigh, reaching up, <sighs> long and strong, okay? You look the way you stretch, so you wanna make sure you're not shriveled up. You wanna be nice and long. You can even reach up to the side, you can go as low as you like, and you can even fold over and stretch the upper back, right? Grab the side of your leg, okay? Stretching the upper back, feels amazing right here, okay? Then you can also stretch your butt just by sitting and your ankle on your thighs, on the figure four, chest forward, keep your ankles flexed. This feels amazing. So you want to keep your, again, neck long, chest up nice and high, pull the shoulders back and just lean over. All right. Keep that ankle flexed to protect the knee, knee and ankle alignment. This feels so great on your glutes. And then your hip flexor, right? You can just flip around and just put one bum cheek on the chair and just drive that hip forward. Drive that hip forward so you can feel it stretching. Keep that glute nice and tight to protect the back. Inhale and exhale. Same thing on the other side, okay? Or again, you guys have to hold these stretches for 20 to 30 seconds to really feel the effects, the tension releasing, okay? I'm going through them quickly so you can practice them on your own. All right, again, driving it forward, being very deliberate when you're stretching to create the tension. You've got to lengthen and stretch and pull and be deliberate, okay? Hip stretch. You can just grab and hug that knee to the opposite shoulder, okay? You can just turn that chest away, chin over the shoulder. You can even grab the bottom of the chair to keep you nice and long. All right, keep hugging that knee to your opposite shoulder. That way you can really feel the hip and then Nice and tall, opening up the chest, twisting and feeling in your back. You can grab the bottom of the chair or the back of the chair. Use the chair as your friend. Create that long, strong pose, breathing. Your breath is very important, right? Your stretch is only as good as your breath because it's the breath that sends oxygen to heal the muscles, right? To give it nutrients. So you wanna make sure you're breathing deeply. So that was it. You covered your neck, your chest, your back, your hips, your glutes. Oh, hamstrings. Oh, almost forgot. Can't forget the hamstrings. So you can sit and just reach over. Ankle flex to stretch the back of the legs, right? This is simple enough to do to keep your bum on the chair. So you don't have to work too hard. Just make sure you curl that toe forward, bring that chest forward, or you can even stand up and do your hamstring stretch. Okay, put your leg on the chair and lean over. Again, don't lock your knees up, keep them soft so you don't hurt the knee over time. Inhale, exhale, lean over, feels good. And don't be afraid to play with some mobility. So just move your ankles back and forth as well, as well as sideways.
to feel every angle of your hamstring stretching, okay? That way you can really increase that range of motion, right? Again, starting with the ankle flexing forward, so you can really feel the pull all the way up your butt and your back if your chest is up and forward. Try not to stretch like this, because then that eliminates a lot of the, the entire stretch that you're supposed to feel. Okay, unless you're stretching your back, that's different. Okay, stretching your back, again, lateral flexion is very important. You don't wanna lose any mobility moving sideways. So I always say stretch up, not just up, but you wanna stretch side. You can use a chair to stretch to the side and down. Pull up, okay, up, side, down, because your body moves in every angle, so you wanna cover every angle. Okay, upside down. All right, so this feels amazing when you open up Push that hip out, reach over, grab the top of the chair, and pull, or you can grab the bottom and pull up. Okay, it's so important that you do every angle of your body, especially the side, because if this gets tight over time, your hips get tight and you can't move very well. Okay, so practice these stretches and remember to hold them for 20 to 30 seconds. Breathe deeply, get really good at it, and I promise me you, you will feel so much better, you'll move better, and your body will thank you and perform for you for the long term. All right, thanks for joining me.